number 10 is a band that's kind of like drama rama it's uh a, this is oingo boingo a band huge in la the song is oh. dead man's party and what do you recall of uh of, of oingo boingo and maybe uh, the song dead man's party in particular oingo boingo in new jersey where we were growing up nobody you know very very they they, they were on the um uh irs cutting edge tv show you know that was mm -hmm. I, I don't even know if 120 minutes was on yet on mtv but they weren't on the radio they were very very underground um they were they would show up in movies and stuff that band they they were they were and i guess danny elfman did the peewee's big adventure soundtrack oh, yeah. so oh, yeah. you know being the kind of guys that we were you know just eat and sleep rock and roll uh after we sold the record store we all got jobs in record stores you know <laughs> um uh, so we knew who oingo boingo was but they couldn't have sold out the roxy in in new jersey whereas yeah. they were playing irvine meadows and 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 you know big giant universal amphitheater and stuff out here um we actually play with them uh, last week in 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 uh, bakersfield and we played with them in Catalina the week weekend before. We've we've played a bunch of shows with them. Oh, this is the everybody of... everybody except Danny has yeah. a band. Uh, it's it's Johnny and Steve and and John Avila on bass and 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 even even uh, Sam Sam the, the saxophone player. Um, it's the entire band except for Danny Elfman, and and they they have a young guy who sings and sounds just like Danny Elfman. They're really good. <laughs> They're, they're, I mean, they're really, really, really good band. They, 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 they really good. Yeah, exactly. Like Journey or, or uh, yeah, yeah, one of those. And so we, we, they're, they're amazing, amazing musicians, amazing music, and and yeah, I, I, I really do like Oingo Boingo a lot. Two questions: Was was there a big audience for you guys in Bakersfield? Yeah, it was nice. We played this old theater, uh, the Fox Theater, which opened in 1930. And uh, yeah, it was fun. Yeah. And did you have a lot of interaction with them back in the day, back in the 80s, after moving here? Oingo Boingo? Yeah. No, never met them until more recently. <laughs> but we were, we're, we're you know, yeah. we're on a first name basis with some of these guys, <laughs> you know. Uh, so Dead Man's Party is from Back to School. Did um, a movie? Did the Did you get, ever get placed in in films at all? You we were that? in. We we are uh, anything. Anything is in uh, uh, one of the Nightmare on Elm Street movies, and uh, another song of ours. Yeah, we've been in a couple of movies, but not. You know, other anything anything also was covered by uh buck cherry it was in uh road trip and our songs were in like Polly shore movies and <laughs> pet cemetery part two and i mean there's a list super uh, 80s you know. okay super 80s yeah you haven't had your kate bush moment yet but it's coming i'm sure ah god only knows you know <laughs> oh i would think I would think that's coming. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, let's yeah, get you Stranger on. Things. Let's get you on Stranger Things let's... next next year on Stranger Things. There you go. Mm -hmm. Who knows? All right. 